Let the physical address be of 32 bit, cash size is 256k words and the cash block size is 4 words. How the 32 bits of the physical address are partitioned for fully associative mapping, direct mapping, two-way set associative mapping and four-way set associative mapping. Assume it to be byte addressable and each word is of 32 bits. As we know the physical address refers to the mean memory and the physical address is of 32 bits and it can be split into two parts the block number and the block offset. To find the block offset here the size of cache block size size of cache block is given as 4 words and the size of the cache block is same as the size of the main memory block and it is of 4 word each word is 32 bits hence 4 into 32 bits which equals 16 bytes that is 2 raised to 4 bytes it's given it is byte addressable so to address each byte within the block how many bits are required 4 bits are required hence the block offset is of 4 bits and hence the block number is 32 minus 4 28 bits and now we are using cache memory cache memory is divided into lines or cache blocks such that the size of each line is same as the size of main memory blocks such that each main memory block can fit exactly into one cache line and suppose fully associative mapping is used in fully associative mapping we can keep any main memory block in any of the cache line and the complete block index or the block number will be used as the tag. So in fully associative mapping how the 32 bits are partitioned the block number that is 28 bits will be used as the tag and the 4 bits for the word field tag equals 28 bits and the word equals 4 bits. And if direct mapping is used, in direct mapping any main memory block can be kept on one specific cache line such that the least significant bits of the block number matches with that line number. So here we have to find the number of cache lines. The number of cache lines can be found since the size of the cache and size of cache block is given. The number of cache lines equals size cache size divided by cache block size which is 256k words divided by 4 words. 2 raised to 8 into 2 raised to 10 divided by 2 raised to 2 just 2 raised to 16 the number of cache lines is 2 raised to 16 hence to address each of the cache line how many bits are required 16 bits are required hence the least significant 16 bits of the block index will be acting as the line number and there can be many blocks which are mapped to the same cache line to identify each of the main memory block we use the remaining bits as the tag hence tag equals 28 minus 16 12 bits hence in direct mapping the word is 2 bits word is 4 bits the line number is 16 bits and the tag is 12 bits and if two-way set associative mapping is used in two-way set associative mapping the cache lines are grouped into sets such that each set consists of two lines and each main memory block is directly mapped to one particular set such that the least significant bits matches with the set number or the set index and in the set it can choose any cache line so here we have to find the number of sets the number of sets equals the number of cache lines divided by the size of the set here the size of the set is 2 the number of cache lines is found out to be 2 power 16 this 2 power 16 by 2 2 power 15 so to identify or to address each of the set uniquely how many bits are required 15 bits are required hence the least significant 15 bits of the block index will be acting as the set index and the remaining bits will be acting as the tag. 
So in two way set associative mapping the word field is 4 bits, set index is 15 bits and the tag is 13 bits. And a four way set associative mapping is used. In four way set associative mapping the cache lines are grouped into sets, each set with four cache lines. So what is the number of set? Total number of cache lines divided by 4. Which is 2 power 16 divided by 2 power 2, 2 power 14. So to address each set uniquely, how many bits are required? 14 bits are required. Thus the least significant 14 bits of the block index will be used as the set index. And the remaining bits 28 minus 14, 14 bits will be used as the tag. So the word field is same, 4 bits, set index is 14 bits and the tag is 14 bits.